Hi there. It'll come as a shock to absolutely no one to learn that the internet is full of cranks, quacks, scaremongers, and outright liars putting out elaborate videos trying to scare you so that they can sell you their snake oil. There's a short video going around by a certain Dr. who says scary things about cast iron skillets. He claims that iron ages us, that we don't want to add additional iron to our blood levels, and that throwing away cast iron skillets immediately causes his patient's blood iron levels to return to normal. This is all quackery, of course, because he doesn't explain how iron is supposed to age us. He doesn't provide any statistics of the supposed increased iron levels his patients have. He doesn't reference any studies at all done by anyone other than himself, and he doesn't provide any numbers at all. He backs up this silly claim with a podcast video where he basically says the same thing and takes a little longer to do it. Here, he claims there's substantial evidence about the dangers of iron, and this evidence can be found in his own published books. <laughs> But again, he doesn't provide any references, any data, or anything at all to back up his little scare story. He goes on to make a really weird claim that donating blood causes people to live longer. And then he tells us to stop eating dark green leafy vegetables like spinach or kale because those plants have high iron levels. And here's another podcast video by Dr. <coughs> where he says iron deficiency is okay, and it has very little effect on our skin and nails, and iron is bad for us. I'm sure folks who are anemic would just love what Dr. <coughs> is saying here. Basically, he's saying lots of things and not providing anything at all to back up his claims, just like every other internet quack and scaremonger. He could just as easily be telling us not to eat vegetables like tomatoes and eggplants because they supposedly contain toxins. Oh wait, he does do that! And wouldn't you know it, his vegetable scare stories just don't seem to have any real scientific reasons for us to believe them. And gosh darn it, wouldn't you know it, Dr. <coughs> is selling his own supplements on his website, just like every other snake oil salesman out there. If this was the late 1980s or 1990s, we'd be seeing infomercials from Dr. <coughs> on late night and Saturday afternoon TV, right next to those ads for Kevin Trudeau's Coral Calcium, Jim and Tammy Baker, and Dianetics. So the next time you see a YouTube ad plugging something from Dr. <coughs> you know what you can do with it. Ignore it and have fun cooking in your cast iron pans. Thank you for watching.